Hey there guys, Eric So2000 here, and this is a tutorial video on how to add custom music into The Sims 4. I'm sure many of you are wondering how the heck do you actually do this, so I'm actually going to show you in this video today how you do it. So to start us off, um, make sure you open a folder um, and go to Documents, and then click the Electronic Arts folder, go to The Sims 4, go to this folder called Custom Music. Now you'll notice many other folders inside of here. Um, do not delete any of them because it could cause problems in your game. Or I, I'm actually not positive what happens when you do that, but just do not do it because um, you might cause some type of error in your game and it will not be good. Um, you actually cannot add your own music folders, so you have to when you download a certain song, you have to put it in one of these folders. Um, yeah, so. I mean that's unfortunate but you're just gonna have to put it in one of these folders like I just said because that's how it works but anyway I'm gonna show you how you actually download the music um, you can take an mp4 video and then trans transform it into an mp3 which is audio which this is what works for this so stand by while I get on YouTube real fast okay so say for example you wanted to download this song called train hey soul sister what you'd have to do is, if I have to drag this up a little bit so you can see the URL up here, there we go. So you notice the URL up here, what you're going to do is you're going to right click on the URL and select this option called copy. And I'm going to show you the next step, so stand by. Alright, so now that you've uh, copied the URL of the MP4 video, you're going to have to get um, something that will transport it into mp3 audio which this is the site that I'm using I basically to get to it I just typed in listen to YouTube on Google and click the second link now I'm gonna put this in the description below to save you guys some time and no worries this is a safe site it will not give you any viruses so no worries about that um, so what you're gonna do with your URL that you've copied you're gonna right click paste it into here and click this convert button and uh, down here you'll notice the name of the song that you've chosen, the duration, basically how long it is, the size of it. Now you can click either of these buttons to download it. Um, so just click here and down below you'll see that it's starting to download. Alright, so it's finished downloading and it's in the download sections. Now if you're wondering how I actually got here, I clicked this and I clicked the downloads. That's how I got there. Um, sometimes it will not it will be really slow and you'll have to like retry a couple times but it does work so just wanted to let you guys know if some if some of you will start commenting uh, you know it's not downloading correctly just wanted to let you guys know that so what you're gonna do is you're gonna click um, show in folder and then I'm gonna drag this over to documents and then you're gonna take it go up put it in the electronic arts then put it in the sims 4 uh, go up again sorry about that um, put it in custom music and then put it in the chosen folder so whenever like whatever folder you put it in is what section the song will play in so if you put it in pop this is where the song will play on um, so if you put it in pop then it will start playing in pop and I have a couple different songs in here already so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial video um, be sure to like comment and subscribe um, and if you have any additional questions be sure to let me know. Um, you know, I won't be mad or anything. I, I'm very, I'll be more than happy to help you guys out. Um, that's what I'm here for. So, if you need any help, just let me know, and I'll do the best that I can to help you out. And I'm pretty sure that I'll be able to help with any with any problem here, really. So, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope it was helpful.